I've never had so many compliments about anything. It's not the bag, Ace. It's the arm it's on. And I, like, swear that I'm not going to let ballpoint pens explode in the bottom of it. Crap. I left my cell back in the car. Are you expecting a call? <sighs> From my dad. He's dragging me to a corporate retreat with his editors. Three days of absolutely Mitchum. Great idea, Mitchum. Can I preach you that food for you, Mitchum? You can suffer through three days. I'll meet you back at the pool house, okay? Don't get lost. Oh, Logan, I thought I heard a noise. Well, Richard, yes, I was just dropping Rory off. Oh, 10 o'clock on the button, well done. Well, I didn't want to keep her out too late, sir. Oh, you're a responsible young man, Logan. Say, how about a nightcap? I have a new single malt I'm dying to break in. Sounds great. <laughs> Look who I found. Logan, you found Logan. How are you? How are you, Emily? Logan was just dropping Rory off. Ten o'clock on the button. A gentleman, this one. Logan, would you like some coffee? Perhaps some dessert? Thanks, Emily, but I've eaten. I thought the two of us would uh, grab a little nightcap. Well, I'll leave you men to your drinks. Good seeing you, Emily. Hmm. Please. So, how are things, Logan? Fine. Good. Back at school, are you? For a few weeks now. Good. Good. Good that you're back. Got any classes? that you're interested in this year? Semester's shaping up okay. Hmm. Thank you. Cheers. Hmm. You working at the Yale paper again? Yes, sir. Apple doesn't fall far from the tree, does it? Not if the tree has anything to say about it. Yes, well, that's good to see you. We don't get many sightings of you young people nowadays, the two of you, ensconced back there at the pool house. Rory's so busy. Her life's a total mystery to us. She could be in the CIA, for all we know. Oh, well, I don't think she's joined the CIA, sir, but I'll check her purse for secret documents. <laughs> so, tell me, Logan, what is going on with Rory? Uh, yours and Rory's life. Ah, uh, nothing special. No? Oh, well, does she have any big plans? Plans? Yes, I mean, the way that girl keeps to herself, we wouldn't know if she was moving to Peru. You two planning on moving to Peru? No, we're not. Well, if not Peru, then what is on the horizon for Rory? And for you, anything different going to happen? I don't, uh... Well, we're thinking of going to the vineyard in a few weeks. That's about it. A trip to the vineyard? Yes, sir. Nothing else coming down the pike? No, sir. Hmm. Well, the vineyard is always nice. Very brisk this time of year. Hey, Logan. What are you doing here? I thought you'd uh, left. I ran into Richard on the way out. Rory, is that you? Um, yeah, Grandma, it's me. What are you doing here? Well, I was just looking for some sugar for my morning coffee. Oh, please, don't get me started on sugar. Uh, Richard and I were just catching up. Having a little digestive. Yes, and Richard, the scotch was great, but I should probably get going given the hour. Oh, of course. I'll walk you out. <sighs> Richard, Emily. Good to see you, Logan. Drive safe. So what were you two chatting about? Oh, this and that. Did it seem like everything was fine between the two of them? As far as I could tell, we're missing Charlie Rose. What was that all about? What was that about? Your grandfather was asking about my intentions. Your intentions toward what? Uh, toward you, us, marriage. What? Why? I don't know. Suddenly I was in there and he was asking me all kinds of questions about our plans and the future and the CIA in Peru. I don't understand. Why would he do this? I don't know. I'm only 20. We're young. We just started going out. Why would we even be thinking about marriage? I don't know, Ace. These are all really good questions. Listen, maybe we should hang out at my place for a while so as not to give your grandparents a visual to latch onto. No. Look, I'll take care of this. I promise. Don't worry about it. Ace, it's okay. You don't have to do anything. No. Oh, this is not okay. This is not cool. I don't want them thinking this. I don't want you feeling like you can't come over here. I promise you, I will take care of this, okay? Okay. Ah. Uh, what? My cell phone's still in my car. Oh, sorry. Hey, if I'm not back in five minutes, it means I'm in the main house picking out China patterns with Emily. 